Hey guys, what's up? It's Shan. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do this red bold lip with a sharp wing liner. So without further ado, if you want to see how I got this look, then continue to watch. Alright, to start off, I'm using this Too Faced Hangover Primer because I am super dry and I found that this is, well so far this is the best that control my dryness. And I'm using that along with the Too Faced Born This Way Foundations. They say when you use two of the same products from the same brand, you get the best results. So that's what I'm trying out here. Here I'm going in with my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. As you can see, it has that nice yellowy undertone, which I love because I have a golden undertone in my skin, as you can see on my shoulder blades. With this concealer, it is really good, but if you are a dryer like myself, you just gotta be careful with how much powder you use on top. But other than that, it's a really good concealer. Then I'm going in with my Hourglass stick foundation to do my contour. I think this color is in Sable. And this is what I had and I really wanted to see how nicely this blended and I really do like the results of how it came out. But I also did the same look with the LA Girl Pro Concealer, one of their dark shades to contour and you really can get the same look. You don't have to spend that much money to get this foundation. Then I'm going in with my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder just to set my under eyes and my eyelids and my forehead and nose. I'm not really a baking type of person. I really just dust it away automatically. Then I'm going in with my Too Faced Dark Chocolate Soleil to set that contoured area. And then I'm cutting the bottom of my cheekbones just to get like a more defined contour look. And then after this, you'll see me like dust away that powder in a few minutes. And this is the powder that I'm using just to get rid of that harsh line right there. I'm using the NYX Epic Ink Liner. This is my favorite liner. I think you've seen it in other videos too, but really I'm just drawing out my, my long dramatic extra wing <laughs> and then connecting it back to my eye. I'm taking my time doing thin like strokes until I get it to how thick I want it to be. I'm also using the Inglot 77 Gel Liner just to show you guys that you can get the same look with a cheaper product or even if it's an expensive product. But I really use this gel liner for sanitary reasons when, I'm, when I have to do a client and they want a wing liner. But yeah, it's really the same thing. It's just with the marker, you don't have to keep dipping and going back and dipping and going back. And then I'm going in with my Goddess Lashes by Coco Lashes. And you really can't go wrong with these lashes. This is like a staple in my collection and it should be in your collection too. I'm going in with my Nicole Guerrero palette and this is my favorite palette. I'll probably use this in every tutorial because it's the best to me. And then I'm just going in with a 
bronzer that I was using earlier by Too Faced just to define my eyelids a little bit. Here I'm using the Brick Lip Liner by MAC. You really can use any red lip liner that you have, but I have bigger lips, so using a lip liner ensures that your lipstick or your liquid lipstick doesn't bleed out. You don't have to do this extra step, but I always like to clean up the sides of my lips because as you can see, there's some of the lipsticks bled out a little bit. So I'm using some concealer to sharpen the edge up, then I'm just blending it out and then setting it with some powder. So when like you drink or you eat or you go party and sweat, like none of that just get all messy on you. And that is it for the look, guys. I really go to this look when I want to do something quick, but I want to still look decent and put together. Again, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, comment, share, all the above. And also hit that bell so you can get notifications when I upload. Until next time, I'll see you guys.